a meet-up for Camembert fans at France's annual farm show. This is not just any Camembert. It has the label protected designation of origin, PDO, three letters which mean the soft cheese was made in Normandy using particular fabrication methods and with raw cow's milk. The difference is the milk is transformed into cheese without pasteurization and heating to ensure maximum taste. Mais on sent que là, quand même, la différence par rapport à ce qu'on achète euh, dans, les, dans les intermarchés et tout. Hein. What you find in supermarkets is another camembert that's half the price. On the wrapper, it says made in Normandy, but only the milk, usually pasteurized, is processed in the region. This mass produced version occupies 90% of the camembert market. Could camembert made with raw cow's milk? be on the verge of extinction. The current PDO label demands strict fabrication methods. Half the milk must come from Normandy cows. These cows produce a little less milk, but it's higher quality, and it's better for making cheese. It's richer, so you can make more cheese using less milk. The cows spend six months of the year outside. They eat mostly grass and hay. The milk is sent to this dairy, one of only a dozen which still makes camembert with raw cow's milk. Production is slow and complex because it's done by hand. Pedio camembert is special because it's made using a ladle, five ladles with 50 minute intervals. We have a range of good bacteria from the raw cow's milk which give a characteristic taste that's unique to our region. This raw milk product will soon not be the only one to benefit from the special PDO label. In 2021, the new revised PDO will include camembert made with pasteurized milk. But David Aubrey sees an opportunity. The idea is to be able to export to countries where PDO camembert using raw cow's milk is not allowed, like the US and Australia. It will be a medium-range product, but still have the PDO label. The 100-year-old company is ready to make pasteurized camembert to conquer new markets. The raw milk classic will be called veritable camembert to differentiate it from the pasteurized version. Confusing double standards, says this member of parliament. Vive la France et vive le camembert. MP Richard Ramos has had boxes full of raw milk camembert delivered to his office. Parfait. Parfait. Ça a une petite odeur de France. Moi, ce que j'aime, c'est sauver notre histoire. C'est sauver une certaine idée de la France. Et non pas une uniformisation à la Coca-Cola. Richard Ramos is denouncing the shift towards pasteurization and the growing influence of big companies, starting with the market leader. Take Lactalis, a company organizing a monopoly on cheese and camembert. Wherever it can buy up parts of the industry, it offers big sums to the owners, well above the value of their businesses. It wants to impose its rules on everyone. So I say, watch out small-scale producers and cheesemakers, because Lactalis is giving you the kiss of death. Right now, you might think you're winning, but it will eventually kill you. Is Lactalis writing its own rules? Despite our repeated requests, the company refused to answer our questions. But in a press statement, it reacted to the operation started by Richard Ramos, saying all accusations that aim to discredit are unhelpful for the dairy industry in Normandy, which needs to create growth, not controversy. We met with the government body in charge of revising the PDO label. Its director denied giving into pressure from Lactalis. Lactalis is à la fois le premier Lactalis is the largest producer of both PDO Normandy camembert and camembert made in Normandy. And so naturally, it was with their input that we found an agreement so that they can themselves be part of enhancing the industry in Normandy de la normandisation du camembert de Normandie. The priority was to end the misleading term made in Normandy. The new PDO will accept pasteurized camembert, but in exchange, companies like Lactalis must adhere to stricter fabrication rules. 
Not good enough, says the activist MP Richard Ramos. Ça sera bon, moi. Ah, regardez, y'a. 577 députés. Oui. 577 morceaux de France. Et donc la suite du combat, c'est Une fois que la France aura donné son point de vue, il va partir à Bruxelles. Et c'est Bruxelles qui, derrière, validera euh, sur l'AOP euh, ce qu'on aura changé ou pas changé. He's hoping the French government will take another look at the new revised PDO. At the National Cheese Championships, David Aubrey's camembert has been awarded gold. He's hoping French consumers will be able to tell the difference between pasteurized camembert and the veritable camembert made with raw cow's milk in Normandy. <laughs>